you know, in Jewish, real deep Torah stuff, it's called, you remove the 10 layers of uh, artificial or self-made, created psychological protection is in 10 layers uh, around the heart. And when you remove them, then you have the nourishing nut of, uh, you know, the, the most nourishing nut of all in the body that, um, you know, has no fear, but can, it doesn't have fear. It has, instead of fear, it has hope and vision. It's something past all that fear and programming, something so good. And, uh, you know, I, I see that in you and I see it in just so many people now. I think the times are just calling for it and we're lucky to be here and, and to be part of it. And uh, I love to see it. So we've always enjoyed you and felt like you. You're very connected and, you know, into the right right kind of ideas. They're not so, they're not just so ridiculous like that fucking Taylor Schneidman. <laughs> What's her name? <laughs> She's a Jew. Taylor oh. Swift. <laughs> her real name is Taylor Swiftstein. She's a Jew. I want to <laughs> smack her. She's just repulsive. You don't like Taylor? And they say she's going to get Biden reelected. I'm like, hey, you're a Jew, even though they changed your name from Swiftstein to Swift. That's true. I'm not, al- I'm not allowed to talk shit about Taylor Swift because my girlfriend fucking loves her. I talked shit. About, I talked shit about her in a podcast the other day, and she oh, no. she interjected, like got on the <laughs> mic from somebody that was off camera and was like, "I love Taylor Swift. Don't you be talking shit about her." Um, but like, she's- okay, well, I'm only talking shit about her Judaism because she don't know shit about her own religion, and the shit she is yammering is making me really pissed off. And I want to say. Taylor or Tyler, whatever your what's her name? <laughs> Taylor Swift. Taylor Swift. Tyler, I love that. Tyler Swift. Tyler. Listen to here. Listen you here, girl. Tyler. Michelle might be a you, Michael. You're a Jewish Taylor girl. A and we know you are. We know where you come from. But you know what? You're on the side of people that don't like the Jewish people. Now you need to learn a little something and meet a certain God you don't know nothing about because you know nothing about your own religion, Judaism. But let me tell you what. Let me introduce you to a guy whose name is God, and you are not. Uh, Roseanne. Speaking for the Jewish people, of which you are one, so you better sit down and STFU, girl, or I'm going to stay on your ass because I'm a Jew and I do the Jewy Jew thing, and you are not going to be up there talking for me. When you don't know jack shit about your religion, okay? Do you have a Twitter account? Because you need it to be on Twitter. A huge one. The best thing on Twitter, in my opinion. Okay. Okay. See, I'm not, I, I don't fuck around. Well, with Jake poo poos everything I want to put out there. He not poo poos. He's like not the fucking true. stall. And now I got a new stall in my own fucking brat. Yeah, Tom, so, check this out. I'm like, why don't you say something uh, intelligible that, like, will, reach a lot of people and she's like i want to talk about something that's retarded <laughs> and then i said how about you don't do that and now i'm it's mind control now you're saying the r word you're gonna get us out of here and i will always say the r word hang on okay you're gonna get us canceled you can't get well, canceled. your girlfriend now nova listen nova that taylor swift she Stain. should not be out there talking about uh hurting her own people and you better listen to what I say there. I'll I'll let her know. But I'm telling you right now that <laughs> there's nothing that's going to convince her to stop being totally in love with Taylor Swift. But I'll let her know. No, no, she's so talented and gorgeous. How can you not be in love with her? But I'm just correcting her. She shouldn't be doing anything political because she's not good at it. She ain't good mm-hmm. at it. She criticized Soros, who bought her library, and then two yeah. years later, she was endorsing Biden. So let's be honest. This is the truth. Uh, a they lot probably of hung her out the window by the ankles of like course. they did to Tupac yeah. over there at Death Row Records. Remember that? Yeah, I do. That was, uh, I think that was, that was Vanilla Shug. Ice. I don't think. It wasn't Tupac, but it was Suge Knight that held him. Yeah. Oh, yeah, Suge Knight. Yeah. I don't know if it was Vanilla Ice either, but whatever. Anyway. It was, the, yeah, the point it was is somebody, she, yeah. Yeah, she's become very critical of the people that the people that own her music are critical of. And uh, that's all you Yeah, know. 
And anyway, she started out as country. I don't know where she thinks she's fucking Barbara Streisand, for fuck's sake. Oh, you see.